What's up Slick Review fans, we're coming at you with another video. Today we're going to check out another home theater projector. This one's from DB Power over on Amazon. Before we get into the box, we're going to head over to the website and check out a couple details. So again, this one is available from Amazon. The link will be down in the description for you as always. This one is a 1080p HD projector that has all the inputs you could ever need. Very bright 1500 lumens brightness and it's compatible with all your smartphones and everything else so very cool guys i'm very excited to check this out it's only going to run you 90 bucks it is available through prime as well so 90 dollars for a projector is a steal already guys and i'm hoping that this lives up to the expectations so it does look very nice here from what we can see already it's got a focus ring and a keystone ring which keystone basically and google all this before you buy a projector but if this is the image, it kind of changes the slant that way and things like that. So that is a good function to have as well. Sometimes you only get focus and not that. So it's good to see that as well. Does claim to be brighter than the competition. Compatible with a large array of devices here. You can play video games, plug in USB, it looks like SD card support. Put it on a tripod, hook it up to a computer, basically anything that it's HDMI or anything like that, this thing should be able to hook up to. So connect with smartphone and iPad through a Wi-Fi display dongle that's not included. So that's unfortunate, you won't be able to run your smartphone or iPad directly through this, but I've got an idea. I'm going to test out hooking up my Apple TV to the device to see if that works, and I suspect it will, but we're going to check that out as well. So here is a grid to tell you what kind of size display you're going to get when you put this at whatever distance. So at about five meters from the display surface, you're going to get about 170 inch display somewhere around there. So keep that in mind when you're planning for a home theater or buying a projector, how far away the projector is from the display surface matters. So keep that in mind as well. All right, let's go down to the website to see what else we need to check out. You guys can pause all that and read it for yourself. And if we scroll down, we have a couple more features here. Again, guys, pause that, read it for yourself. So head through the link down in the description, but right now we're gonna get straight into the box and check this thing out. So it comes in a nice, pretty basic black packaging here. So we're just gonna get right into it. So right away up top, we get the various propaganda here, your quick start and your instruction manual. So we'll set that off to the side. On the one side here, we have a box labeled projector accessories. Let's go ahead and see what we've got in there. Okay, so inside that box, we have a remote to control the projector. Nice. Basic power cable. Your three component adapter, if you would like to use that. And we do have an HDMI cable included in the box as well. So we'll set all that off to the side and let's check out the projector. Okay, let's get this packaging off of here. And there we go. So taking a tour around, just like we saw on the website, it has a very nice premium feel to it. I mean, this is all plastic here, but it's nice and heavy and it just looks very professional. So let's take a tour around. So we do have a lens cover there. And as we saw on the website, focus and keystone adjustment up top. Infrared sensor for the remote, come around the side. Large opening for the fan. And here with all the ports, we've got three five millimeter audio, USB input, output to theoretically charge like a smartphone, something like that, a large full-size SD card slot, HDMI output there, on the back VGA output if you'd like to use that, another sensor for the remote, on the side power, and then up top some buttons to navigate through the on-screen menus. So again guys, this looks very nice and it has a nice heavy feel to it. But I know what you want to see. You want to see how it works, right? So let's go ahead, get it all hooked up, and see this thing in action. All right, guys, so we're going to do a quick demo of the projector here. So I've got it up against a wall, and I estimate the screen is probably about 170 inches. Just to give you a little perspective, just down there is the door to the garage. So if you compare that to the size of the screen, you can get an idea for how large this thing is. 
So here's the main menu that you see when you fire it up. It shows all the different things you can do on the projector. We're going to go down to Source, where I've got an Apple TV hooked up through the HDMI port. But as you can see there, there are all the different input options that you can use. So we're going to select HDMI. It'll take a second to switch. And here's the screensaver for the Apple TV. So we're going to check out a couple different media types here. First, I've got Inglorious Bastards put up here. My name is Lieutenant Aldo Rain, and I'm putting together a special team. I need me eight soldiers. Eight Jewish American soldiers. Now, y'all might have heard rumors about the Armada happening soon. Well, we'll be leaving a little earlier. We're going to be dropped into France dressed as civilians. Once we're in enemy territory, so that looks pretty good. So guys, we're going to head down to Netflix and just pick a random show just to turn it on so you can see how it all works. We now return to America's Next Top Model. So guys, I do have the audio playing through an external speaker. But even the speaker on the main unit's not all that bad. I'm going to unplug the speaker real quick, just so you can see how that sounds. You have no idea where I come from, where I've been, how long I've been there, what I had to do to get from where I was to where I am yet. So, as you can see, it's a lot different and not necessarily something you want to use full time but it is actually passable compared to some of the other projectors I've checked out before. So guys, I'm very impressed for 90 bucks. Let's head back to the table for the rest of the review. So guys, as you saw in the last part of the video on the demo, this projector performed very well. Um, so the features I do like, it again, it does have keystone adjustment there as well as focus, of course, and it ran flawlessly through the Apple TV. Now at the larger screen sizes, you do see a little bit of graininess with the video. I don't think that can really be avoided, and it wasn't really that noticeable anyway. I actually, when I hooked up Inglorious Bastards, I actually sat down and watched it for a little while because it was pleasant enough to watch on there. Um, even with the built-in speaker, now again, I wouldn't recommend relying on it, but even with that built-in speaker, it wasn't really, it wasn't horrible, which the internal speakers usually are with these entry-level projectors. So even that wasn't that bad. I did hook up an external speaker through the audio port, and that, of course, worked a lot better. Um, but what I'm trying to say is for only 90 bucks, this one is a winner. This is by far the best projector I've ever had the opportunity to take a look at, and we've done a few here on the channel, and this one is by far the best, and it's priced very competitively. So absolutely 100% win guys I have no issues at all recommending this it's only 90 bucks and I think you get a lot of value for your money there so yes this can hook up to an Xbox PlayStation Apple TV pretty much anything that has HDMI you can run through this it's basically a television so anything you can hook up to a TV will work on here if you guys have any comments or questions, please leave them down below. I try to answer every single one. Find me on social media so you can stay in touch. But most importantly, guys, hit that subscribe button so you do not miss any future videos. That's all I've got for you this time, guys. Slick Reviews, out.